Robotics and embedded systems make up a $100 billion emerging industry. Robots are being used in classrooms across the United States to teach science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. Over the last nine years, Carnegie Mellon's Robotics Academy has offered on-site professional development to over a thousand teachers at the National Robotics Engineering Center. The center is part of Carnegie Mellon's Robotics Institute, one of the largest robotics research organizations in the world. The National Robotics Engineering Center conducts research for companies like Caterpillar, International Harvester, Toro, and General Motors. Research conducted at the center impacts transportation, healthcare, energy, agriculture, and utilities. This is a great place for teachers to learn about real-world robots as they study robotics education. The tour of the center is always a highlight with teachers. What will you learn while you're at Carnegie Mellon? Training is available for the NXT, VEX, and Arduino hardware platforms. In class, teachers learn how to program robots using NXTG, LabVIEW, or RobotC software depending upon the class that they sign up for. They'll also learn about mechanical considerations, troubleshooting tips, how robotics can be used to address standards, and strategies to address common classroom issues that all robotics teachers struggle with. The goal of the Robotics Academy staff is to send teachers back to school confident that they're ready to teach their students. What does a typical week look like? Begin by traveling to Pittsburgh. We recommend that teachers stay at the Shady Side Inn. The Shady Side Inn is located in a safe neighborhood not far from training. There are many nice restaurants, shopping areas, and places that you can walk to. The inn provides a daily shuttle that brings guests back and forth between the inn and the Robotics Engineering Center. Classes begin each morning at 9 o'clock and end in the afternoon around 4. On Monday, we start with a general overview of the state of robotics, new industries that are being created, the impact that robotics is having globally, and robotics in education. After the presentation, teachers build their robots and are ready to begin class. Classes follow a workshop design where teachers initially experience the lesson from a student's perspective. Then, each student lesson is followed by a discussion of how that lesson might play out in a typical classroom. You will be learning from the team that developed the training materials as well as from experienced teachers that have used robotics in their classroom for several years. Summer classes are made up of teachers brand new to robotics as well as teachers that have been teaching robotics for several years but are eager to learn more. During the week, after class options range from dinner at a restaurant with a group, taking in a baseball game if the Pirates are in town, or touring the city via a river cruise. We do this every week. Lunchtime meals are provided every day but on Friday, when classes conclude around noon. Teachers in each session leave with a DVD that includes digital copies of all of the worksheets used during the week, a copy of the PowerPoint presentations used by the instructors, copies of all the programs written during the week, and the contact information of the teachers that were in your session. The summer is the most exciting time at Carnegie Mellon's Robotics Academy. We enjoy working with teachers and we love showing them our school and our town. Please contact us if you have any questions.